Hi guys, Pookie here. And today what we're having for dinner is soup. Black chicken ginseng soup because my beautiful wife, she's sick. So I made her ginseng soup for dinner. All right, so the preparation for the, the ginseng soup is very simple. It's just one white chicken and all these other ingredients. Well, you know what I mean? This is not a cooking channel. It's more like an eating channel. So I'm just letting you guys know a little bit how I made this soup. <laughs> but if you want to see like, you know, more detail about chopping, what ingredient, how the chicken look like, like you know, you're in the wrong channel. Man. <laughs> you, know, you know, mainly my channel is all about eating. Well, any, any, anyway, um, how to make the, um, the black chicken ginseng soup is very easy easy you know what I mean this is like the Asian recipe you know what I mean a lot of you Asian folks know this this recipe man trust me it comes from older generation people you know what I mean like like older folks they love this chicken soup I'm pretty sure you guys you know what I mean you guys are Asian you you know what soup I'm talking about right it's the black chicken uh, ginseng soup right so I I I but all the ingredients to make the ginseng soup, the, you know, the preparation for, you know what I mean? The whole pot of soup is about 50 bucks, you know what I mean? A chicken, a piece of beef, you know, and all the other ingredients to make the soup. Well, Nia, she don't like uh, black chicken, so I bought the regular chicken instead to, to cook the, the pot of uh, uh, ginseng chicken soup, all right? So just stay tuned to see how my ginseng soup, uh, you know what I mean? look and taste like you know what i mean my, my wife is like she's sick so you know what i mean i'm gonna feed her first before i i feed myself <laughs> you know <laughs> that way i get to eat more you know <laughs> like you know whenever she can't feed us i eat it all. <laughs> all right all right peace man see you later love you guys hi guys Pookie here all right so right now my ginseng uh Black chicken soup is ready. I know you can't see my bowl because this is not a, a cooking channel. It's an eating channel more likely. So I'm gonna eat this this soup and, and to see how it tastes like. Well, you know, the chicken soup, it's very simple. You know what I mean? You just um, mainly just buy a, a chicken right here. This is a, a piece of chicken breast, all right? This is the chicken breast. And then a piece of beef, you know, here you go. I, I think the beef mainly give the soup the, the sweetness, you know what I mean? This is the, the beef. And then the, the ingredient pretty much is like with ginseng and all these other stuff. I don't know what to call it, but there's ginger. This is the ginger, all right? And there, there's like a dry Logan, all right? So I'm pretty sure you Asian folks out there know exactly what I'm having for pretty much dinner. Right, so there's no need to like you know flash up my ingredients, <laughs> you know. But then you know let, let's let's try this soup out. You know what I mean? You know I love this this soup, man. Every time when I eat this soup, you know the first thing that popped in my head, you know you know what. You know, every time I eat this soup, I don't know why, it just reminds me of senior people, you know, like older, uh, like, people, you know what I mean? Because every time I eat this soup, man, you know, it just reminds me of old people, man. Every time when they go to a restaurant or something, I always see them, man, ordering this soup, you know. So every time when I eat this, you know, I go in deep concentration and think about them. It is really true, man. You know, senior folks, man, they love these soup, man. You know, I, I don't know about other race, but then, you know, Asian folks, you know what I mean? This is their best soup, man, for the seniors. You know what I mean? It's also my special soup, too. You know, I, I love this soup, too. You know, this is like a roast uh, beef. It's really soft and, and tender. It's really good, man. Mmm. You know, usually when you cook this soup, you have to use black chicken. You know, that's the special ingredient. That's why they call it the black chicken ginseng soup, because you got to use the, the black chicken. But then, you, you know, my, my wife, she don't like black chicken, you know, because like, you know, she, she think like, you know, black chicken has this odor. So, so she don't like black chicken. But me personally, I love black chicken, you know, it, it has a different taste. That's the odor that, that my wife don't, don't like. But you know what I mean? 
with this chicken is still good though, you know what I mean? But it's not the ingredient to make the soup. You're supposed to use like the black chicken to make this ginseng soup. But hey, it's it's all right, you know what I mean? Chicken's chicken, you know what I mean? Well, here it is. You know, this soup is really good, man. You know? Oh, here, here you go. This is the ginseng. You know, for many of you folks that love ginseng, you know what I mean, just like I do, you know what I mean? Then, you know what I mean? This ginseng is, is perfect for you, you know? Like, uh, ginseng is supposed to be good for your health, you know? So, I don't I don't know that. That's what they say, you know what I mean? I guess that's the reason why I don't get sick easy. Me and my daughter, Savannah, we don't get sick that easy, man. Like, e even if you're sick and you're around me and I eat your food, I still don't get sick. I don't know, man. My immune system for, like, you know... Like, for sickness, it's very immune, man. It's like, it, you know what I mean? I don't get sick easy, but if I do get sick, I'm pretty much, like, you know what I mean? Knock out. You know what I mean? I, I guess that, that's the, the scary part about me. Because if, if I if I don't get sick very often, and when I do, I guess it just knock you out, man. That's what they, they say about people like me. <laughs> you get what I mean? So, so if I ever get knocked out, Nia has to cook me ginseng black chicken soup. <laughs> no, no white chicken, you know? <laughs> you know? She's gonna say, oh honey, can I cook you white chicken? I said, no, black chicken. <laughs> you know, I personally love black chicken. You know, black chicken ginseng, you know what I mean? Dude, I you. You know, you know what I love, you know, the black chicken, you know what I mean? I, I love to squeeze a little bit, like, you know, soy sauce into the chicken, you know what I mean? Man, it's perfect, dude. Hey, but 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 it's it's still good though, man. I I, I love it. You know? Hmm. The beef is really good, dude. You know? You know, I, I think I should dip this with A1 sauce, you know. <laughs> you know what I mean? Hey, beef, right, with A1 sauce, it's really good, right? Maybe I'll do that later, you know what I mean? Let, let me test it out, see if it's good with A1 sauce. Like, you know what I mean? Like ginseng roasted, whatever. Chicken soup, you know, dip with uh, A1 sauce, you know? <laughs> mm. Well, you know, this is gonna be our dinner because it's very filling because I ate like like a breast of chicken here and a piece of freaking like, you know, makes beef, you know, I mean? a, a roasted beef, you know? There's no need for noodle or rice, you know, I mean, this thing will fill you up, trust me. It'll fill you up, man. That's a lot of meat here, man. I'm telling you, dude. You know, I'm wondering what you guys are eating right now for for dinner. You know, I always wonder what my friends eat for dinner, man. I'm telling you, you know what I mean? Okay, you guys like you know, like you know, comment sometime. You know, just say, oh, Fuki, I'm having this for dinner. You know, so I know exactly what you guys are having for dinner every day. You know, so you know, just comment below, like you know what I mean? Hey, Fuki, hey, your ginseng soup is really tasty. I'm having abalone for dinner. <laughs> You know, or, or like, you know, some of you guys, like, you know, I'm having roast duck, you know, hey, good for you, roast duck is good, <laughs> you know, I always wonder what my friends having for, you know, I mean, for dinner, what they're having for lunch, you know, that that's what I always think, you know what I mean, like, you know, you know what I mean, what they eat for dinner, you know what I mean, <laughs> well, this is what I have for dinner, it's ginseng, you know what I mean, ginseng, black, well, actually, it's not black chicken, it's just uh, chicken ginseng soup, I guess, you know, you know, the thing about this, I don't know what this is called, you know what I mean? I, it, it's like a little uh, yellow thing, something berry. I forgot what, what berry it is, you know? It has a different taste to it. 
And and this thing here, I think this is date or something, right? It's like a, a dry stuff. It, it's all dry stuff, man. You just have to just cook it up, like, you know, in a, in a pot of water. You know, the date actually give out the sweetness to the soup. You know, that, that's what I, I love about it. I, I love these date, man. It's really sweet. You know, I, I guess this recipe, you know, I'm missing something. I don't know. Because, you know, I ate this soup before at, at a friend's house. You know, the I, I guess their mom made it or something. It's really delicious. I don't know what she used for, for the ingredient, but it's very tasty. Well, my soup, you know, the, the way how I, I, I cook the soup is just really basic cooking. You know, nothing fancy about it. But I, I guess there, there's like specialty to how to cook the soup to... To the max, you know what I mean? Because I taste this soup before somewhere else. Like even at the restaurant, it tastes really good, man. But but you know what I mean? Like let, let's just say if I give that the restaurants a ten, right? My soup is about an eight. You know what I mean? I, I guess because I'm not a professional at, at cooking these type of soup, but then hey, it still tastes very similar to that soup, and it's really tasty. You know what I mean? If you guys want to, you know what I mean? You guys can say, hey Fuki, can you cook the the black chicken ginseng soup one day, and I combine the test? <laughs> Hey, you know, that's cool, you know what I mean? You know, just bring the ingredient, I'll cook for you. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys, you know what I mean? Hey, you, you guys know, right? My channel is not a cooking channel, it's about eating channel. And I, I noticed, like, you know, a lot of you guys say, you know what I mean? Hey, Cookie, can you film yourself eating this, eating that? Hey, dude, I could eat anything, man. Just, you know what I mean? Ship the stuff you want me to eat to my house and I'll eat it. I'll, I'll make a video on it. <laughs> you, know, you know, it's really funny, you know? Like, you guys say, hey, Cookie, can you eat the whole pig? I'm like, damn, of course I can eat the whole pig, but you know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean? Ship the pig to my house. I'll make a YouTube video eating that. <laughs> I remember the the last time I bought a roast pig. The whole roast pig was was my daughter's um, one year old party or something. I, I think back then it was like about four hundred dollars for the roast pig. I think the roast pig, the the, the small uh, roast pig, is like four hundred bucks, four hundred or, or five hundred, so somewhere around there, like way back then. Like I I say, it, it's about ten years ago. All right. It, I bought it for like four or five hundred bucks for the the roast pig, so I, I I don't know how much it costs nowadays. Nowadays maybe a little bit more, maybe six seven hundred dollars, maybe you know for a roast pig. And and if you if you and if you were to ask me to freaking make a video, you know, eating a roast pig, you know, maybe that that's like you know, maybe a minus uh, six hundred dollars from my checking account. <laughs> So, so I was thinking, hmm, what's the best way to uh, to make a video of me eating the roast pig? You know, so I come up with two um, two way. The first way is either you guys ship the roast pig to my house and I'll make a video out of it, right? That's the first way. Or the second way is when I have a party, like a birthday party for my kids, you know, I'll buy the whole roast pig, right? And I'll film the video eating the roast pig first, right? I'll eat the roast pig first and I'll fume. And then when the guests come, you know what I mean? I can still serve the guests, right? Because there's no way I can finish the whole roast pig. So I get the first eating and filming it. So when the guests come, they're like, oh, nice pig. Um, Oh, did you have guests over already? I'm like, yeah, uh, they, they just left. <laughs> you know, I think that's the best way, man. So if you guys, you know what I mean? You know, one day you guys come to my party, you know what I mean? And I have roast pig for for the party. You know what's going on, right? So when you walk up to the roast pig, you just look at the uh, the player pig like... Fuki, you just feel yourself, right? <laughs> I'm like, how did you know, man? <laughs> oh, man, I'm just kidding, though. Hey, but uh, for sure, one day I'm going to feel myself eat, eating the whole roast pig, you know what I mean? But that, that's my plan, you know what I mean? Because, it, you know, it, it's very intensified, you know? Like like some something that, that's thrilling, you know? Like a, like a whole big pig, you know what I mean? But for sure, there's no way I can finish the whole pig. So I was thinking about making a video one day, you know, with, with, with a bunch of my friends, you know, eating the whole roast pig, you know? I want to film one epic video, you know what I mean? 
a really epic video of like 10 friend, 10 roast duck or something. You know what I mean? 10 friend, 10 roast duck. So, so the thing about the video is like, you know what I mean? If, if, if we have 10 people willing to participate, you know what I mean? We're gonna get 10 roast duck, right? We gonna cut off all the 10 roast duck uh, butt, you know? And we leave on a plate like that, okay? Okay, so this is the trick, okay? The loser, all right, it's gonna have to eat all ten duck butt at the end of the video. The loser, okay, and then and then yeah, there's gonna be a reward for the winner, okay. The winner gets to get all the duck that is left over on the uh, the table at home plus uh, a soy sauce duck to go, okay. <laughs> all right, that's for the winner, and the loser is gonna have to eat all ten duck butt. All right, all right. If you guys are watching this video and you're in town and you want to participate in this duck eating contest with me, all right, uh, just let me know, message me or email me. You know, make that hey, sign me up. You know, me when I have enough 10 players to participate in this game, I will, you know, me get this thing to, like you know, me on the road. You know, we, we can start filming, you know, an epic eating video. It's called 10 Friend. 10 roast duck, you know what I mean? Or 10 friend, 10, 10 duck, something like that, okay? But the catch to the story is, is that, you know what I mean? The loser, the, the loser is gonna have to eat 10 duck butt. I'm telling you, man, I am not gonna eat that duck butt because you, know, you wanna know why? Because I'm gonna freaking look at application. Let's see, you know, oh, this this oh this girl look weak. I, I, I don't think she can beat me, you know what I mean? I'm gonna select her. <laughs> and, you know, if you got, you guys, what if you guys like big and, and chunky and stuff, you know what I mean? Like, like huge, you know what I mean? I'm like, oh, disqualified. <laughs> dude, I'm not gonna eat that 10 duck butt, man. <laughs> but dude, that's scary. I have never eat a duck butt in my whole entire life. I tell you, man, never, all right? I never eat duck butt, chicken butt, man. Tell you the truth, man. A lot of people say that, dude, they're they're delicious. They're tasty. I'm like, man, that's gross, dude. Don't you guys feel that way too, you know? You know, but but I know some, like, you know, a lot of people, they love chicken butt, duck butt. But me, you know, in my whole entire life, I have never tasted duck butt or chicken butt. I would never want to lick no duck, duck chicken butt. <laughs> you know? <laughs> That's not my taste, man. If you guys like duck butt, chicken butt, you know, when you eat with me, you can have it. <laughs> oh, man. It's so funny. <laughs> All right. So that's my one, one of my epic videos that I want to film. And I hope you guys can actually participate in, in this, this, like, you know, eating contest, you know, with me. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I think it's going to be a very fun video to watch, you know, 10, 10 rows pig or 10 no no the 10 roast duck with 10 friend or one roast pig with 10 friend you know something like that you know I me mean? we, we have to do something that reasonable you know I mean? we, we can't do like 10 roast pig with 10 friend you know that's unreasonable how are you gonna eat 10 pig man 10 people with 10 pig <laughs> you know it's unreasonable i don't even think you can finish the whole duck by yourself i eat that before you saw my solo video you know I me mean? you know I me mean? it's not easy man i'm telling you dude you know so mainly this soup here, it's it's really delicious, man. Like you Asian folks, you know what I mean, out there, you know, I mean, you know exactly what type of soup I'm having. So there's no need to film the, the you know, the, how the soup look like. So, you know what I mean, it's, it's really delicious. I love this soup, man. But the thing about this soup, every time I drink it, man, I'm telling you, you know, honestly, you know, that the first, the first thing that popped in my mind is senior people, man. I don't know why, dude. You know, I mean, every time, you know, you know, like, like, you know how people say every dish that you eat, it reminds you of something. That's exactly what I'm trying to say. You know, I mean, this dish reminds me of, of older folks, for real. Every time I, I sip on the soup, you know, the, the taste of it, like, like, you know, there's a ginseng or something taste to it. And, and that taste just pop into my head, like, you know, a senior, you know, I mean? it, it's really true, man. Old folks love this soup, man. Well, you know, like, you know what I mean? This soup is very filling. Yeah, I, I, I think because of all the, the juice or the fat from the, from the, the beef or the chicken, you know what I mean? It, it, it's marinated into the soup. 
And when you drink that soup, it's very like thick and, and rich, man. I'm telling you, dude. I think that's why it fuels you up, man. You know? But you know, if if you guys never tried this soup before, you know what I mean? Um, and you wanna make this soup, let me know, you know what I mean? Let, let, let me know. I, I I can show you the recipe. You know what I mean? I, I'll put the the link to to the recipe maybe somewhere here or somewhere here by the, the end of the video. So just click on one of the link here or here. Just click on that link and um you know what I mean? Just uh I'll, I'll tell you to pay for forty nine ninety five, right? Just uh pay with your credit card or whatever forty nine ninety five and I'll give you free shipping. You know what I mean? After you make the payment, I'll, I'll give you free shipping on that. You know, it's on me. You know I me, mean? it's on me. All right. So after you make the payment, okay, you can email me or message me. Hey, Fuki, I just paid. Okay, and and, and I'll, I'll message you with uh, the recipe again. Okay? <laughs> All right. Hey, dude. You know I me. Mean? Life. You know I me. Mean? We we gotta hustle, man. How you think I survive, man? How you think I'm gonna have money to buy these this? This this soup to to ingredient to make the soup, you know what I mean? So click on the link here or, or down here by the end of this video, and it'll take you to another website, you know what I mean? And you know what I mean? When, when you get to that website, you can enter your credit cards or you know what I mean? PayPal or whatever. Just pay for it, forty nine ninety five, and now I will email you the recipe, okay? <laughs> All right. So the recipe, you know what I mean? It's it's trust me, man. The recipe, you know, it's well worth it, man. Forty nine ninety five, man. That's all I'm charging you guys, man. You know what I mean? It's really cheap, dude. I'm telling you. <laughs> dude, all right, if you don't believe me, right? Let me let me show you how how good this soup is. You know what I mean? Look, all right. Look at how tender this 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 chicken looks, man. Look at it. My recipe is it, well worth it, man. I'm telling you, dude. You know, <laughs> you know, you know, guy. I'm just kidding. There, there's no link. There's no forty nine ninety five. If you want to know the recipe, I'll give you for free. You know, <laughs> you, you know, because nowadays, you know, what I mean, if I don't want to give you the recipe, you gotta Google search that recipe. <laughs> You know, no one's gonna pay forty nine ninety five for a recipe nowadays. <laughs> you know, it's all mainly free nowadays. You know, don't you agree? I agree. You know, well, guys, well, the soup is pretty like, it, you know, like like I say already, I grade myself. You know, this soup here, I would give this an eight because you know what I mean. Hey, if it's not worth a ten, I'm not gonna give my own self a ten. You know, this soup only a value like an eight. You know what I mean? With my cooking, only an eight. But then, you know what I mean? I tasted soup before from uh, from restaurant, you know what I mean? Dude, man, trust me, it's, it's a tan, dude. It's really delicious, man. They they can actually, like, I don't know how they do it, but they're really specializing in these type of soup, man. It's really delicious. Every time you, you taste that soup, you, you know what I mean? It just hits you right in the spot, dude. I'm telling you. But, you know what I mean? This soup is still good. But when you drink this soup, you, you gotta make sure it's hot, man, because Cause when it's not hot, it tastes like kind of fishy or something. You know what I mean? If you you know what I mean, you know what I mean. It has to be really hot, cause cause when it's like warm or, or something, you know, like like you, you can tell, okay? Right here, there's like, you, you know how how the chicken oil or something, it, it just like it dried up into like like freaking butter or something, dude. You know what I mean? That's the reason why it's, it's so rich when you when you drink the soup, man. You, you don't even have to eat nothing else, man. You don't have to eat rice, noodle, or anything. You can eat just a few bites of these chicken and drink the soup too, man. Trust me, you, you're filled up. Trust me. Well, guys, I'm kind of like full already, you know? But hey, today I like to introduce you with one of my soup uh, recipe. It's called the um, uh, ginseng chicken soup. You know what I mean? This soup is really good if you're like, like not feeling well, like sick or something. You know what I mean? You should drink this type of soup. It gives you a lot of protein. You know that's what you need when you're sick, right? So that's it. You know my soup is done, and right now I think I'm gonna. <laughs> Have to go blow my nose. I think, I think Nia got me sick, man. You know, all right. 
All right, guys, thank you for watching and make sure to follow me and subscribe to my channel, okay? Love you guys. Peace.